hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm Horace that you're watching possible now so guys today i'm going to guide you about how pro players get zero input delay in fortnite by applying these simple settings you just need to watch the video till the end and if you're new on the channel kindly of subscribe to the channel like this video share it with your friends and without any waste of time let's start the video so guys before starting the video let me introduce you the best tool for fixing ping and input lay issues in your games give up store it's simple and easy to use you can try it out with a three days free trial all you need to do is add your game click once and you're good to go check out the link in the description to get started so guys method number one is optimize usb ports so ensure that your latency sensitive devices like your mouse your keyboards or controller are plugged into the correct usb ports so usb uh, tree viewer a free safe tool to check your usb configuration and uh, plus plug these devices into the usb root hub typically found on the back of your pc and directly connected to the cpu uh, regarding usb 2.0 versus 3.0 while linus tech tips found minimal difference in latency uh, certain high performance devices may recommend usb 3.0 for optimal performance always check your device manual for specific recommendations so guys after that method number two is adjust mouse settings in your windows so a proper mouse configuration reduces input delay in your game so set your pointer speed to the uh, default 611 in the mouse properties and uh, disable enhanced pro pointer precision to avoid mouse acceleration which can negatively impact accuracy and uh, for wireless mouse position uh, the dongle close to the mouse for minimal signal delay and uh, after that guys method number three is maximize polling rate so polling rate determines how frequently your mouse reports movement to the pc set it to the highest available uh, preferably thousand hertz using your mouse software higher polling rates minimize lag and micro stutters and uh, improving overall precision. Method number four is optimize DPI settings. So choose a single DPI setting that fits your playstyle and delete unnecessary profiles to streamline performance. A DPI of 800 to 1500 is often recommended for better tracking accuracy. So guys, after that, uh, method number 5 is manage mouse battery levels. Some wireless mouse uh, enter a low power mode when the battery drops uh, below 30%, affecting performance. Keep your mouse charged above this uh, threshold to maintain optimal responsiveness. And uh, after that guys, method number 6 is disable RGB effects. RGB lighting may look cool but it can introduce slight input delay by texting your uh, peripherals, microcontrollers. Disable RGB effects in your device software to prioritize performance or aesthetics. And uh, in the end guys math number seven is set monitor refresh rate correctly so maximize your refresh rates for smoother gaming experience adjust this in both your nvidia control panel and windows display settings to ensure it's set to the highest available rate this tool set this dual step process ensures your system and monitor are fully synchronized for minimal for optimal performance and uh, these tips may seem minor but combined they are significantly enhance your gaming responsiveness if you found this guide helpful feel free to like subscribe and use my creator code for support and uh, check my description for games back and uh, we will meet in the next one until then peace out